Sani Abdul Majid, a level 400 student of the Department of Health, Physical Education, Recreation and Sports, died after a backflip he attempted doing in a celebration of his final exams went bad. He was reportedly rushed to the 37 military hospital but died two days after. He was on Saturday morning buried in Bipe's hometown in accordance with Islamic traditions. The family say they are devastated by his passing. Here are some brothers of Abdul Majid who spoke to City News. It was very sad when we heard the news because he's a student and also in his final year. I think I spoke with him on the 4th of this month and then uh, he told me he will, be finish, he will be writing his final paper on the 5th. Only to hear that my brother uh, had an accident. So quickly I rushed to where they admitted him. And then uh, later they said he has been transferred to uh, 37 military hospital. Uh, in fact, it was very sad when I got there. Looking at the extent of the injury, it was, it was very bad. And uh, actually, in fact, we are not happy at all. We are not happy. We are still mourning. Anyway, we are giving him a defeated barrier. But we hope that uh, God will give him a better place. I say, say, one of the brothers, Mr. Ablai Abbas, say their deceased brother will forever remain in their hearts. Majid is a very sincere person. He's a hard-working guy. And everybody knows him. Uh, Majid somebody he try to entertain people like he can come to you and ask you what is worrying what is your problem share your life with me and he tried to entertain you so because of that he was loved by uh, by all his friends this acrobatic display is his usual thing he has been doing since he was a kid. Uh, but we don't know. We we'll say uh, God knows best. But for me, I will continue to pray for him. This is the family house of Sani Abdul Majid, the final year student of the University of Winneba who passed a couple of days following an accident. He was buried this morning in accordance with Islamic traditions. The family say they are devastated about his passing because they were looking forward for him to complete school and come and contribute his quota to the development of Ghana and to the family. For City News, I am Richard Fogo reporting from BP.